track. Holy big cow, big crack. car upside down on the back straightaway. Carl Long has crashed hard and collected Bobby Labonte in the process. Man, Carl's car just took a wild tumble. Joe Nimic Oh, he's okay. Yeah, Nemechek wow. must uh, Nemechek was up in that too somehow. Sixth caution at lap 263, and there is Carl Long. He is okay. The Al Smith Dodge is a mess. I'll tell you what, it's been a long time since I... The last time I saw a car tumble down the back straightaway like that was Bobby Allison in the Mercury of Roger Penske's in about 1976, I think it was here. Bobby took a wild ride down the back straightaway. He's very similar to that. It's something you just don't see. Not here. He climbed up that... What happened is he climbed up that wall and he got the thing up on that wall. It just started turning... It turned over and started tumbling. You know, Paul Wolf in qualifying the other day in the Bush Series climbed that wall. He just about turned over, but did not. Let's see if we Ooh. can figure out what happened here, guys. Get a, get a look at this. There's Bobby Labonte. The blue car in front, 46. 46. Somebody hits Oh, Nimichek. he just gets hooked. Yep. Yeah. Look, Brendan Gaughan got into the back of Joe Nemechek in the 01. Brendan Gaughan the 77. Carl Long goes for the wild ride. And that's all on driver's side right there sliding down the racetrack. Now she starts to tumble. One, two, three, four, five. About five and a half, six times. And almost landed on top of Bobby Labonte. Jeannie? Although, guys, Bobby Labonte isn't really complaining too much. He says there's really not a lot of front end damage. He says, certainly I have some flat tires. I'm going to have to go behind the wall. the 97 off pit road, Steve. That, Jamie McMurray saying his car is loose off the corners. They've already made a chassis adjustment, a wedge adjustment, four tires. Ryan Newman's team finishing up service. Matt Borland and crew. 18 cars on the lead lap. I believe, I believe McMurray may have beaten the uh, everybody off pit road. There's what's left of Carl Long's car. Once again, he is okay. After this bad tumble, Brendan Gaughan gets into the black car of Joe Nemechek, and the 46, the blue car, goes skyward there. Yeah, Nemechek being up under the back of the 46 car lifted it up and got it up on the wall. It was Mark Martin that turned Bobby Labonte there, and Labonte was way close to Man, that. Look how high that car got right. It got a lot of air there at one point. At actual speed. run out of room back there. I mean, you're probably running well over 150 miles per hour right there in that, that area. Ricky Rudd had to drive through it. Let's ride with him. That's when you call your crew and you say, you won't believe what I just saw. <laughs> 